Hello everybody, my name is Gadamo, welcome back for a new series, new game boys, How can by you mutant, it's out, died. I'm gonna shut up right now the boys, there's actually a little dialogue going on already. Tribes stand divided, in need of someone strong enough to unite them, or bring them all down. This is a story with an unusual beginning, so let's expect an unusual ending. Alright, well, Biomutant boys, starting off, I don't know if that's Sean Bean, but it does sound like Sean Bean to me, boys, I don't know, uh, we'll see. But uh, this is going to be a fantastic game. I can already feel it. I'm probably going to lower uh, the graphics or something. Let me uh, jump on into the menu really quick. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, settings. All right. Let me uh, see the settings. Maybe uh, the graphics a little bit. Camera. Video. Sharpen uh, brightness. Change the brightness a little bit. Yeah, probably br put the brightness right. Okay. Yeah. Brightness is a bit better now. I don't know what was up with the brightness, boys. It was all over the place. Let me figure out the controls. I, this is an RPG, by the way. That's all I know about it is the, the fact that it's an RPG. Uh, the, look, the game looked fantastic. So I just wanted to play it, obviously. It's going to be interesting. Camera shake? Uh, I don't know. I hope there's not a lot of it. I can always change it uh, if, uh, if it's the case. Depth of field? Yes. Uh, speech? All right. Sure. Uh, yes, I do want speech over it. It seems like the speech can be fine. Comic book effect. Interesting. Comic book effect is a thing. Okay. It's already on though. Damage numbers. Uh, enemy indicators. Not really. We'll keep it as it is for now. We'll change it if I need If I want to change it. Subtitles. Small because uh, medium is a bit uh, too much. White. Yeah, sure. Why not? Uh, colors. Let's change it. No, let's keep it to white, I guess. And subtitles, background, off. Let's put it at off, actually. Yeah, I need it to be off. That's better for me. Background, opacity. Automatically complete quick time events. So there's going to be quick time events? Well, that's very skillful. I'm going to put it off for now. If I can put it on later on, if I'm absolutely horrible at the game, which is probably going to happen, then uh, I'll say, sure, why not? But right now... I'll keep it as it is, boys. Let's jump on in. So I already know, uh, since we know that there's going to be like um, quick time events and everything, that's going to be interesting. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know what's going to happen. Your DNA. All right. So primal is a number. Okay. So we're going to choose what we want to be. Is a uh, nimble, developed, anthropic breed, a hybrid with a gen gene mutation making uh, them nimble and dexterous at the cost of lesser developed intellect. All right, so what do we want more, boys? Charisma. You can always see charisma is, is the same for everything. Charisma is always uh, important for me, uh, for my characters in RPGs. Uh, so charisma is the same, so I don't need to look at that. Vitality is going to be the important part for me. Uh, strength, not so much. I think vitality and, uh, and luck, uh, mostly. Agility as well. I want a lot of agility. But the agility and charisma seems to be um, good. Morgul seems to have bonuses on charisma as well. Uh, intellect a lot less though. I don't know which one I want to take the most. I kind of want to take vitality quite a lot. It looks like uh, it doesn't look good though. Uh, Ila. Regenerative developed. Okay, so he can regenerate himself. That's quite good, boys. Uh, luck. It goes down a little bit. Critical chances. Kind of like this one quite a lot, boys. I think I'm going to take Murgle. 
because uh, critical chances are going up, loot chances going up as well, agility stays the same, charismas go up for bar uh, barter as well, and vitality and strength are kind of the same. So I'm going to choose uh, this one, the Murgle. Uh, it, uh, idea is brief, so it evolutionary lineage has gone in a direction where form and appearance has dominated over function. So yeah, I'm going to take this one. I like the Murgle quite a lot. All right, so define your character's starting attributes to see more details, explanations of what each attribute has uh, press. Okay. All right, so if I want strength, oh, I see. So strength, vitality, and everything, so I can actually modify it myself. Interesting. You already know vitality is a strong suit for me, but charisma quite a lot. I want a lot of charisma, boys. Uh, charisma. So I'm tempted to go in between right here. But I do want some agility. I don't know why agility is going down. Well, you know what? Uh, I'm gonna just... I don't want to put it too much. I want to kind of put it a little bit... You know what? I, I'll put it uh, at maxed out. Why not? Uh, right there. I think in the middle right there. In the middle is good enough. So uh, more health and more charisma. Uh, Downs great quite a lot. My intellect and my strength. But my agility uh, as well. But... Uh, at least I'm going to have some charisma and vitality, which is the most important fi uh, thing for me. So that's what I'm going to take. All right, what is this? So uh, genetic resilience. What are, we, uh, what are we talking about here? Okay, so what are we, okay, so what are we resilient to? Biohazard, cold, radioactivity. I'm going to say eat and radioactivity mostly. So I'm going to do 15% of each, I believe. Or 15% of, uh, of eat. Let me uh, put it up like that. There we go. And 10% of ra radioactivity, boys. That, that's just cosmetic at this point. All right. So that's just uh, cosmetic at this point. You know what? I kind of like this one because it looks like a Deadpool type, uh, type of thing or Spider-Man type of thing. Uh, the way it looks. This one, I like it a lot, though. It has like a, a little bit of a scar type, uh, type of thingy. So this one, I like quite a lot as well. What about uh, any other ones that are interesting? I like this one. I like this one quite a lot, boys. The other one. This one, yeah. I'm going to take this one. All right, so we got to choose our fur. Um, what color do we want? Well, the scar, the scar, I, it, it, it depends on what the color of my, uh, of my uh, background. So the white fur, I, it depends on what the white fur is going to be like, the color and everything. I don't know exactly what I'm going to take. Right here, I think black would be great, I believe. So just plainly black, I believe, would be great. If I choose it like that, I can I choose it just simply black? I can, I can. So I can put it so it's black altogether. I think that's the best option. And that's the, yeah, that's the background one. Yeah, okay, so I can come back afterwards. Kind of wanted to do this one first since it's the one that you see the most. Actually, your green looks badass. Green looks badass. What about uh, blue? Well, blue looks kind of good as well. I wouldn't put red. I think red would be would go would do really well, boys. But yeah, I think red looks kind of cool. But I kind of like green quite a lot. I'm gonna put greenish, boys. A little bit more. There we go. Background right there. So dark green with some uh, some black scar on it as well. Yeah, I like that quite a lot. I'm gonna put that. All right, so what is my class? Uh, Mercenary, Deadeye, Dead Commando, Cyrex. Uh, so this is basically a uh, range dude. All right, Saboteur. Saboteur. Okay, Sentinel. and uh, Sentinel. Seems like a big dude. Base armor is increased, yeah. Saboteur. So Saboteur, melee duel. So this is a melee duel. That would probably be me, boys. I like the melee duel quite a lot. Um, dodge energy cost is reduced. You know what? May may um, duel. It's probably the way to go for me. What about fury? Range weapon attacks. Okay. Dead eye is more of a I don't know normal one. Mercenary is just the regular melee one. I'm gonna take saboteur, boys. I like this one quite a lot. Yeah, I like the uh, the the idea of being able to have two uh, two weapons at once. So I'm gonna do this one, the dual ones. So we're good to go. I think uh, I've got everything. Stat detailed, everything. Yeah, I think uh, we're good to go, boys. Let's start it up. Sounds good. Sounds good.
All right, so player movement, we're starting off. Yes, player camera and everything, as you can see. All right, good. Yo, my char look at my character, boys. He looks great. He looks fantastic. I put it green too, so I can um, see. They can't see me. The enemy can't see me if I'm. Uh, I can be undercover, right? I can cover myself into nature and stuff like that. So that's great. Oh yeah, you already you already know what type of combat I'm going to be. Full Yola style too. I'm full green. Imagine if I went full green, I would have been literally Yoda in that one. All right, so um, we're, I choose a path in life that fork can root. So I gotta you, choose. It's not only a crossroad, but a choice, a reflection of your key, the primal energy that flows through everything. So color bl light blue for freedom or loyalty. Dark red is strength and power. Oh. So this is like a Jedi thing or something. This is like Star Wars or something. What the fuck? We actually have some choices to make, boys. I where to go. Freedom and loyalty? Or strength and power, boys? I'm gonna go light blue. There we go. Let me introduce myself. I'm the light. So you look like Ori from the game, like from the game and stuff. The hell? Echo of balance and consequence of your actions as you move forward. Alright, so I'm not sure light is for me. No, you get it. I'm bright. Yeah, I'm gonna. Like I'm on the bright side, boys. I don't think I'm gonna come around. In your nature, and here I was hoping we'd be all about natural selection, survival of the strongest, and so forth. If that's not instinct, then I don't know what is. <laughs> natural selection is all about evolution and progress, and as soon as there's enough light, darkness will disappear. Alrighty then. Looks like we're going to have a devil angel type of ordeal right here. We're going to have to make our choices as time goes by. So, uh, aura somewhat light. So, I chose my aura to be somewhat light. Okay, so we can be dark side or light side, I guess. Depending on where to go. So, which way do I go? I think I'm going to go here. I'm going to go here, boys. Right is always right. Right is always right. Yeah, always go on the right, boys. When you're lost to a labyrinth, you always go on the right. All right, let's see what we got. So you already see, you already, uh, you already know I'm about to uh, to be full Yoda in combat zone right there. This has a skull on it, so I don't know if I should go here, but I'll go here anyways. Let's see what we got. Stories of death from the bodies left behind, a reminder that we're at the mercy of nature and the one that preys on others. Alrighty then. Meat eaters meat. Okay. So uh, we got to eat. Uh, well, we got to eat. I guess we got to do, do what we got to do. Do you the beast that shattered your family? Or did you choose to forget? You turned your back on our world and got lost in your own. Meanwhile, the predator only grew stronger. What is this? First boss fight? Oh, fuck! Alright, come at me, bitch. I'm ready this time. Alright, let's go. Let's go, boys. First boss fight. Woo! Let's go! That's what I'm talking about right here. Alright. Feather slide. Oh, shit! Look, I'm fighting like a rocket or something, boys. This is gonna be fantastic. Oh, alright. I see it. Alright, alright. Alright, uh, so what do I... Oh, shit. Oh, okay, 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 I see, I see. All right, all right, so uh, I can shoot, basically. Okay, so basically, yeah, that's the tutorial and everything. All right, so I don't see, there's not any bar he uh, of health right now, so. Parry, there we go. Okay, so you can parry and stuff like that as well. Not gonna be much of a parry, guys. Uh, parry the dude, r really, boys? You already know me, that's not my style, really. So, uh... There we go. Just jump. That's going to be more of my style right there. Just jumping to the enemy's face and literally shooting at him. 
I'm gonna be super jumpy. That's my style. That's the way I was playing on uh, Ghost of Tsushima and stuff. So let's go. Kill him off. Woo! All right. Oh shit. Yo, watch out, buddy. All right. Oh, okay. Uh, do I want to shoot him? How do I? Oh, okay. Okay. There we go. There we go. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Uh, how do I shoot him exactly? Oh, that's how you shoot him. You just do that. Click, click, click. The hell do I have to... Um... Ah, there we go. Just range as hell, boys. Re reload, reload, reload. Boom. Oh, shit. All right. No, go, 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 go. Got him. Oh, shit, man. Damn. He's uh, he's kind of dangerous. I can't shoot him. He's got that, uh, that natural defense, so I can't go into, uh, like, an attacking and stuff like that. Oh, my God. Son of a bitch. No. All right. So live to fight another day. So I have to actually run away. I see you. I thought I was gonna... I needed to kill him or something, but I guess not. This time, it was best to run and live to fight another day. Let us hope you're ready for it when it comes. Well, I'll be ready for it. All right. All right let's get the fuck out of here. I don't know what that peeper is, but doesn't sound good, boys. All right. So I can choose... Uh, clench tabby, crunch tabby. Okay, so I can choose what I take, I guess. I'm gonna choose both, I guess. Oh, okay, so I can be melee and everything. Okay, so I can choose to have only one weapon as well if I want to. That's kind of cool. I like that. Alright, let's go, boys. Let's get the hell out of here. Alright, so where are we right now? The predator isn't the only threat. The wildlife started to mutate when the end of days began. And the tree of life started to die. All right, sounds like a bad thing right there. Melee target, aim at the t the camera. Okay, so, oh, so you get the target itself that you can shoot. No, you don't, bitch. Woo! Let's go. Get it, get it, boys. All right, shoot these motherfuckers. Go, 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 go. Boom! Let's go. Parry, 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 parry. Let's go, boys. Are we gonna do, do a bunch of stuff? No, you don't. All right, uh, there we go. Just shoot these uh, these assholes as well. There we go. Go get them, all of them. All right, that's what I'm talking about right here. All right, dodge, dodge. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. There we go, just like that. On the home stretch. Attack him, there we go. Jump, just like that. All right, we got him, all of them. Just down there, I'll open the door. So I got all of them right there. That's interesting. Just a way of uh, doing the combat, boys. But uh, you already know, I'm going to try my best to uh, to see how I'm going to fight, Reed. I've got my own different fighting style than most gamers and stuff. So, there we go. We got this. Itaru style, boys. All right, so what is this? Electric module weapon add-on. So, this is like a mod and everything that you can get. So, equip. Let's equip it. Weapon add-on. Okay, so now I equip it. What, what happens when I equip it? Oh, look at that. Look at that weapon, boys. Holy shit. It looks badass. All right. I, I don't exactly know. Okay, so I think I'm good. I think I already got it equipped. Okay, so we got some health right here. Medic supplies. Yep, I already uh, saw it. Pretty simple enough, I guess. Uh, take all. There we go. Oh, there we go. So, oh, it's like uh, Resident Evil uh, kind of the way it works. It's kind of uh, a Resident, uh, like a Resident Evil and everything. Like you loot stuff and you... Like, I like that. I like that quite a lot. Interact. Oh, shit. What? All right, take this. How did I get some health from the toilet, boys? That sounds kind of strange. Not gonna lie. All right, let's get, uh, let's get uh, on the top right here. Good to go. I love the look of my character so much, boys. Just looks the badass. Sludge? Everywhere. What is this? To most, you want to attack me? Bitch. No, you don't. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Get change. them. All of them. All right. Evolution this guy I got him. All right. Uh, I'm going to actually shoot them. Yeah, parry. I know. Go, go, go. No, 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 you don't. No. Oh, my God. I did not expect that. For Oh, shit. This guy. Watch out now. All right. So get this guy right here. I'm about to jump. Go, go, go. Jump. Oh, shit. Maybe the jump is system will work. All right, so I got him. He's dead for. He's dead for good. Got him. 
Yeah, got him for good. He's dead for. All right, so we're good, boys. Oh, look at the way I'm going. All right, so what is that? Some uh, just a bunch of looting, I guess. So this is all going to me. A bunch of junk, I guess. Uh, get everything, uh, every single thing that we got. Every time it goes slow more as well. Oh no, it's just because I'm on the. Oh, defeated. All right, restart last point. I guess I sh I wasn't supposed to go in there. All right, well we're starting over, boys. I guess. Uh, same place we were. Yeah, same place. So I can't go into these things. I guess if it says Dev Zone, I should probably listen to what it's showing me, right, boys? Rocket boo, uh, Rockaboom. All right, defeat the Rockaboom. Whatever that is, that that's gotta be the um the. Oh, what the fuck? Yo, that's that's very unpleasant, my guy. You didn't need to do that. Let me read it all really quick. No, you don't. Get him. There we go. Okay, jump, 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 jump. Jump. All right, let's go. Let's go, boys. All right, let's jump, jump. Okay, we got him. Just jump. All right. That's Boom. Look at that. I'm doing all sorts of flips. I love it so much. Doing all sorts of flips. I got this right here, whatever this is. Bunch of junk. Uh, all right, so I think uh, we're just supposed to follow the road, I guess. Where are we going? I don't know, but man, I like I like this game already. It's gonna be fun to have a, a little bit of a simple uh, RPG and stuff. Been a while since I've played one of those. Uh, I think the last time was uh, I don't even remember actually what what was the last game I played that was an RPG. Uh, Iron Wall Shielder. What is this? So what is this? Is this like a trap or something? Oh, gotta sh gotta shoot the shit out of him. Reload. No, you don't. All right, so boom, just like that, boys. Go, 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 go. Shoot him. There we go. Got him. No, 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 no. No, you don't. No. Okay, let's go. We got it. Go, go, go. No, you don't. No, no. I got him, boys. It's a st start jo dodging like crazy as well. There we go. Got him. All right, we good. We good. Got him. All right, he's dead. Just like that. It's actually getting uh, pretty easy. Interact. So I can, uh, yeah, I can uh, loot from the uh, enemy as well. All right, good. Sounds good, boys. Sounds good to me. All right, so I only have these types of bullets right now. Anything I can loot anywhere? Let me uh, get these guys real quick. There we go. Just get him. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. Get him. There we go. Just like that. Just like that. Get him from behind him, boys. I think I got, uh, oh, got uh, both of them. Level two already. Good. All right, so level up. Let me see how it works. What's the skill tree? Uh, that, that's the map. That's the map. There's probably going to be some... Look at the map, though. It's pretty huge. Yeah, it's actually a pretty big map. I like that. Um, where do... All quests? No. Oh, there we go. There we go. So uh, that's imagine character level up. So let's see the skill tree and stuff. Increasing attributes. So I can increase elf. Oh, that's how it works. Okay, I see you. So this, that's how it works. Uh, agility, for sure. Uh, my charisma is already pretty big, boys. So I'm just going to upgrade my agility. Upgrade points. Close combat, range combat. Close combat, for sure. Unarmed. Two, uh, two wielded melee. There we go. Uh, going to upgrade this. So I've got one of those. Unstoppable pig. Uh, yeah, let's do that. X, X, and Y. Let's do that, boys. Upgrade this. So I'm going to... Uh, that's like a, a new ability and stuff. So you get abilities and all. All right. I got you. I got you. All right. So uh, we good? Wang Fu. What is this? Clung, uh, close combat. Range. Basic range. Okay. So I have pretty much everything. Perks. General. Okay. I, I see you. So we got a bunch of stuff we got to look into. Aura. Which is basically light right now. You can see. Uh, I went to the light and everything. Okay. I see you. Uh, what about other things? Gear. Let's take a look at this. So I imagine uh, outfits is different costumes I can get. Yeah. Do they do anything? Do they change anything? If I like don't take anything at all. If I go butt naked. Is, does it change anything? I don't know actually boys. I don't know if it changes anything. Oh it does. The armor. You can see the armor. It does. So, um, all right. So, I got to keep an eye on that. Inventory, I got that. So, the torso, face. I can get something into my face. Maybe a mask or something. All right. So, I'm probably going to get some masks and stuff like that. Interesting. 
So I interact with the, uh, let's interact with this guy. Take everything. I'm taking everything. I'm going to loot a lot of stuff, boys. Anything that I can see, I'm, I'm looting it. Let's go in. Uh, let's go into here. Look, All right, what is this? An emergency box from the once was a rare sight. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's Sean Bean, boys. If it's not, it sounds a lot like him. Uh, common old world claw bar. So it's just another weapon, a new weapon, I guess. Uh, do I want to take? So what if I go now and uh, and basically go here, gear, uh, inventory. There we go. And tools. So this is a tool. What's it used for? What do we use this for exactly? I don't exactly know. Uh, it's going to tell me, I imagine, if I get a new weapon and stuff, right? I'm probably going to know this. Uh, it looks like the crowbar wasn't a... It's just a tool I can use to open doors, I guess. All right, interesting. Interact with this. So uh, further up, what is this? Fan stuff. All right, open the door. That pipe looks weak. The claw bar should come in handy. A claw bar. So I guess we can use a claw, a claw bar now. All right. So that's what we use that for. Okay. And now we can go inside. Is there any way? There's nothing to loot, I think. No, I think we're, we don't have anything Whoa. else to loot, boys. So we're good. That's a big jump. It's time All right, let's go. Way out of this place. No, really, I mean it. All right. So let's see. I like uh, the voice quite a lot. Oh, that's scary. scary. Yeah, we got to uh, watch out. We can't go into these uh, uh, oil things, I guess. Uh, oil death and stuff. What is this? That's this to sound like a good thing to me. I imagine that's what the resiliency was all about. The morks produce biomatter in their multi-organ that they shed under distress. Blobs that affect the cellular coding strands of any living being when absorbed, including you. Motherfucker! You want to attack me? Let's go. Special attacks as well. We got. All right. No, 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 no. No, you don't. No, you don't. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Just like that. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Jump. Right, let's go. We got him. Uh, just like that. He's actually not attacking me at all right there. I don't know what he was doing, but he wasn't attacking. So uh, I like how they uh, renamed the uh, the enemies as well. I like that. So we're good to go now. All right, so this place looks like a dangerous area. Let's get the hell out of here. This did not look like a safe area right here. All right, let's take the door right here. Got to uh, get out of the bunker? Sure will. Exit the room. All right, these are very simple uh, objectives right here, boys. Just get out of here, I guess. I got a feeling there's going to be a boss fight coming up. Just got a feeling. What is this? Uh, first off, always want to look, boys. Always want to look. New gear. So, always want to look what we got. So, what is this? Consumables. So, we can choose which one we want to use, I guess, right? Swift so move health pack. Yeah, we can choose what we want to use. I Well, these things could be good enough, I guess. The syringe uh, first. It's, it's exactly... This game plays exactly, I guess, is the same mechanics as a Resident Evil, I guess. It's the same type. So, I guess syringes are better than... Uh, Health kits at the fir uh, first time, at Toxamon least. You want to use your health kits uh, right away. To save themselves from the impending doom, but was it too late? It is only from the flight logs of the single arc they left behind that we know other arcs traveled through the sky and beyond. It seems those that came before us never lost hope in finding a new home for their kind. Well, maybe we can find a home for ourselves. Uh, we got we got to look into something right here. First off, let's lock open. Lock. It's locked, locked. All right, so maybe we got to find something from here. Anything that I can loot right here? Anything interesting that I could loot? Uh, this is where I come from. Nothing simple. I can't go there. Okay, so yeah, I got I to gotta look into this. What is this? Time lap or, or intellect puzzle. Oh, not puzzles. All right. You can rotate this number of rotations, whatever. Uh, I gotta put this one right here. Like that. There we go. Sounds fine by me. Okay. What about this one? Uh, this one, I gotta put it like that. All right. Completed. That's all right. That's it. All right. It's not that difficult then. There are few records of the chain of events that led to the big apocalypse eons ago. 
but it's clear the world wasn't prepared for how recklessly the Toxanor Corporation would make its mark on the world. Their rare earth mining and nuclear industries generated tons of waste, and without consideration for the future, they dumped it all in landfills until they ran out of space. That's when they made the big mistake. They began dumping the toxic waste in the surf just off the coast instead, assuming that it would sink and decay with time. And they were right, but no one was prepared for what was about to unfold. Once in the surf, the radiation interfered with the genetics of the wildlife and created bizarre mutations in their offspring. It had an inconceivable impact on biodiversity and the entire ecosystem. The world as they knew it crumbled as nature retaliated. It would never be the same again, and what remained of it became ours. Hmm. Sounds like a real life problem, boys. But watch out for these oil things, man. You can't just dump that in there. Eventually, they're gonna have to figure out how to dump that somewhere. I mean, into space, you can dump it into space. Uh, if we're developed enough, eventually we'll probably be able to do that, right? Alright, so get out of the bunker again. Seems like a pretty simple objective again. Some what is this? Metal going pew pew is never a good thing. It's coming yeah, I, I'm gonna second you to that one. A warning label. The box looks like a potential brain melt. Huh. So you want me to use that probably? Uh, all right, so we're gonna end it for right now. Uh, it's a pretty short video, I know, uh, but I gotta go to work soon, so I couldn't do a long video uh, for the first part. Uh, for the long, uh, the next parts, it's gonna be a bit longer if I can do it. Uh, uh, it's this game came out a little bit of a wrong time right here. Came out in the middle of the week. When I'm actually working, you know, it's tough to uh, to find some time to uh, do videos. But I would definitely do want some video, make some videos on this game. This game is fantastic already. So remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.